it is me. Long time, no tea. Yeah, it feels like ages since I've done a video, but as you can tell by the title of this video, I have a Lush Kitchen subscription to show you all today, so I'm very excited. So without any more further ado, let's just open it up and take a look-see at this fabulous collab box, shall we? Ooh, hopefully I don't drop it. All right, here we go. Uh, so this is, I guess, for my times doing the Lush Kitchen, this is now my second collab box that I have had because the last box that I did was the Spongebob and I skipped August because I'm not a minty fan but now we have Lush um, X glitter box so ooh ooh fun inside hmm the inter it smells it smells interesting um so it says rave bathe glitter box Lush interesting I'll turn around on the back and you can like scan the little QR code if you feel so inclined and check out what's on the inside of this box. It says, we're collaborating with Nightlife Phenomenon Glitter Box to help you shine inside and out. Cool. So I'm gonna set that right there, make it look all fab in the back. Ooh. Oh, we got a note. It says, dear subscriber, you may have noticed an item missing from your box. Don't worry, our kitchen team are hard at work producing a fresh batch of just for you, but it's not quite ready yet. We apologize for the delay. Aw, well that's a bummer, but I guess that means that I will get to be seeing that at a later date. Okay, so I'm gonna put the spoiler paper aside for now, and we are going to get these packy peanuts on the floor, because I just love making a mess for myself, and the cats just love it when I make a mess. Alrighty, so, ooh, okay, first thing I see on top is a bath bomb. Absolutely gorgeous. I think I remember, it looks really familiar. I think this came out lots of Valentines ago. Oh, but it smells so good. This is like so typical lush smell. Okay, I'm going to take a quick peek at the spoiler card just to see what this one is called. Heartbeat, that's it, Yes. Okay, so this is the Heart Beat, and it has doo -doo -doo, cocoa butter, popping candies. Ooh, so we have rose absolute, rose oil, geranium oil, and lemon oil, and almond oil. It's almost kind of like rose jam, but with a little bit of a difference. Oh, I'm so glad. I've missed this smell. Okay, next. Ooh, we have a dust. We have a dust. I can't remember if this was one of the things we voted for, though. So we have Candy Fluff Dusting Powder. I haven't had one of these since the... I think my first time buying from Lush. I think it was called, like, Sandman or something. It smelled like lavender. But this is... Candy Fluff Dusting Powder. Your skin will be on cloud nine thanks to this sugary sweet dusting powder. Get ready to sparkle. Oh, is it sparkly? Ooh. So... And that looks sparkly and beautiful. It says it has Persian lime oil in it. And I'm just peeling away the little thing right here because there's always a little secret word. Oh, and there it is. The secret word is sweet talking. Yeah, if ever you get a product that has like the sticker on it like this, peel it back and there will be a secret word underneath. Okay, I guess I have to, I want to smell this and see what it smells like. It just poofed in my face. <laughs> I bet my face is glittery now. Okay. Ooh. It kind of smells like... A bit like Smarty Candies. Well, okay. It smells like American Smarty Candies, because apparently Canada and everywhere else has different, so it kind of smells like a, like a sweet, limey kind of, like, candy. So that is fun. Okay, next. Next, 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 next. Ooh. Ooh, we got a perfume, glitter box and lutch, shake and spritz, glittery body spray. <gasps> oh, okay, we got we got glitter right there. So, okay, I'm gonna shake you up before you go go. Ooh, okay, so I don't know if the camera will be able to get, it, but you can kind of see it swirling in there. Okay, let's get the little teeny tiny cap off. Ooh, 
Ooh, smells familiar. Ooh, he's sparkly. I just, I look like Edward in the sunlight. Hmm. Okay, so, I don't know if you can kind of see any sparkle at all. I don't know. You can see. I can't get it to show on camera. I can see it right now. My hands are absolutely glittery. I look like I should be in twilight right now. But, uh... It's not exactly my cup of tea. I might have to gift this to someone because this smell is just not doing it for me. It says it has grapefruit oil and pettigrin oil. I mean, well, that's like the only two scents that I recognize as things, but I normally really like grapefruit. Maybe it's a pedigree oil. Not, not a fan. I love the concept. I'm really bummed that it's not a scent that I like. Okay, next. <gasps> Ooh, we're going old school. We have a bubbly bar. It says happy on it. I wonder if this is a thing that's bringing memories to me when I when I got this box it was so nice the UPS guy he honked when he pulled in and he honked when he dropped it off he always knows to make sure to be extra careful with my boxes because well it's always good to have a good friendship with your local UPS driver but he knows to be gentle with my lush boxes but the smell of I don't know if maybe it was everything together it was giving me like flashbacks to lush UK had big bath oil tablets like several Christmases ago and one of them the way it smelled to me the combination of scents it was almost like a cigarette smoky kind of -ness. that's the way it you know my nose read it as and something in here kind of is giving me that vibe it might be the perfume maybe the perfume but the happy bubble bar smells really nice this one is neroli an orange flower and sandalwood and tangerine oil mmm so crumble under warm water, run bath, and let your optimism rise like the bubbles. It's so cute. And it makes me happy. Clap along if you feel like lush is the thing for you. Okay, next. Okay, so of course there's a lotion that is missing because I guess they must have had problems making it. So the last item it looks like in this box for now, maybe... I might have to dig around a little bit better. Is this super shimmery, glittery, it almost looks like a little disco ball. Bath bomb. I bet it's gonna be called disco ball. What is it? Glitter bomb. Okay. Ah. We have our culprit. So one of these scents my nose does not like. Ah. No wonder it smells familiar to the perfume because it is also grapefruit oil and pettigrin oil. So, apart, I like those scents, but when they're together, not so much. So I might have to be gifting this one also, because it is, it is just, um, not for me. Which is kind of a bummer, because I was really looking forward to that one, because I think that was one of the ones we voted for. But I'm very happy that I have the Beating Hearts bath bomb to make up for it with its gorgeous smell. Like, this is like Valentine's Day at Lush for me, 100%. Love that. Okay, let's see. Is there anything else in the bottom? Well, no. So that you know what that means. <gasps> let it snow. Let me have peanuts everywhere and let the cats go crazy when they come in and see the goodies to roll around in. Okay, I'm just going to slide that off because my left was just covered in it. Oh, I am so glittery right now. Oh, twinkle, twinkle, little me. Okay, then. Well, everybody, I hope you have enjoyed this Lush Kitchen unboxing. I feel like this one was a bit quicker than normal. Maybe because that one extra item was missing. But um, I guess the Glitter Bug Lotion is going to have almond oil and neroli oil and rose absolute absolute and vanilla absolute in it so that by the sound of it that's gonna be something that I'm really gonna like I cannot wait until it gets here to try it out and let you guys know maybe I'll make like a YouTube short let me know in the comments down below would you like me to do a short when that lotion gets here of how I like it please let me know down in the comments below and if you're interested 
there's going to be another video right here for you to watch. And if you are new, welcome to my channel and go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that you never miss my videos ever again. And if you're interested in supporting my channel, down in the description box down below, there will be a link to join in my YouTube memberships and that just helps support my channel and help support my shenanigans. So that being said, thank you so much for watching everybody and I will see you all later. Bye!